Brian Cash joins us now from Audio Warehouse to talk of talk tech here this morning. So what have you got? It looks like R R T R D D two. What did you say? R two D two. R two D two. That's yeah. what I was trying to say. Yeah. Some people think it looks like R two D two. Some people call it a garbage can. So what is it? It is a wireless speaker. What? Now they advertise it as a wireless outdoor speaker because it's uh, basically weatherproof. Yeah. So you can have it outside, but it has way more uses than just an outdoor speaker. Um, it comes with this unit here, okay. and this is the transmitter. So this is a dock. It's actually an iPod dock. So I would say this is by far our best iPod dock unit that we have in the store as far as sound, basically because it has about four speakers that run around the side here. Okay. Um, it's got a powered sub built into it, so it's got an 8-inch driver in the bottom, so the sound is amazing on it. So where would you use this? Like in a hot tub setting or? Uh... Everywhere. Okay. Because what you can do with this base is you can hook it up to, you can plug your iPod in, yep. okay, leave this plugged into the wall, this sits in your house. Could be sitting beside your stereo system, could be sitting beside your computer, and what happens then is you've got an input on the back. So you can run a cable from your computer into here, you can run a cable from your stereo into here, you can run a cable from your satellite box or whatever. Any music that you have, any sound that you have, will then be transmitted from here to here. This thing has just about a 300 foot range, so it'll basically work anywhere in your yard. And you said that this has a subwoofer too, so what, how much of a you know, base would this thing put out? Lots. We've had it outside the store, we can actually run it outside the store in the parking lot, whatever, light up the whole street, so if you want music, um, out at the lake even. Guys are using it, taking it in their boat, taking it on the beach. Wow. Um, now what you do there is you've got the range between these two units. Like I said, if you've got this set up in your house, you're basically good for anywhere in your house. Outside on the deck, you want music. Um, by the fire pit, uh, you want music in the garage. You want music upstairs. Wherever you want music in your house, you just pick this up and carry it there. It does have a power cord that plugs in um, to recharge the battery. Right. So you generally have one main area where you have it. Um, but then when you want to use it somewhere else, you just unplug it, pick it up, and carry it wherever you want. How popular are these right now? Because you don't, you know, you typically see a lot of people, like if they have a hot tub, they, they mm -hmm. build them out outside speakers. Yeah. Are these been, have these been selling quite They've well? They've been selling very well. The, the, obviously, like you said, you can do the outdoor speakers, yeah. okay? So then you take your stereo, you try and run some wires out, put speakers there, now you're all set up, now you have sound at your hot tub. What about your garage? What about your basement? What about, you know, this thing you can just move anywhere. The other nice thing is if you get out of range, so let's say you want to take this to the camper, mm -hmm. you want to take it down to the beach at the lake, it actually has a plug-in on the side. So now I can take my iPod, I can plug in a regular headphone adapter, plug it into the side of here, set it on top. Now I have a powered speaker for my iPod that works anywhere. Wow, that's pretty amazing. It, it's awesome. It really, the flexibility is just amazing on it, the sound quality. Um, I don't know if I mentioned one of the girls said, oh, you said last time nothing good is wireless. This is probably the only good thing we have that is wireless. Um, it, it's really amazing. Now, you touched on it too, but just in the break. What if, what's people's, uh, you know, interpretation when they see this thing? Did, you said yeah, a lot kind of, of people, yeah, a lot of people look at it and go, thing. okay, I want that R2-D2 thing or <laughs> the one that looks like a garbage can. Um, but really, it, it's the functionality of it. The sound quality is amazing. Um, the fact that it is waterproof, you know, or weather resistant. If you right. happen to leave it outside on the deck or you leave it sit outside, it's not going to be wrecked. So the flexibility is definitely there with it. And like I said, for most people running an iPod or music off anything, here you go. How much would one of these things run? Uh, this unit retails at $9.99. Yeah. We have them on sale at $8.99 right now. There's also a smaller unit for about $5.99. The smaller unit actually has a little bit um, more flexibility in the fact that it runs on a 12 volt system so it actually comes with a car cord so if you're out somewhere camping whatever you don't have power you can plug it into your lighter to power it up or to recharge the battery awesome thank you very much brian cash from audio warehouse we'll send it over to lindsay dunn and carrie smith